Yes, there really is a bird called a nutcracker. And the only nutcracker in North America is the Clark's nutcracker. I encountered these Clark's nutcrackers at a high elevation lake in Wyoming at about 10,000 feet. And I had a really excellent vantage point on a hillside overlooking uh, some pine trees where I was actually filming right at eye level. So I really kind of fell in love with these birds and did a little research on them and they're really pretty fascinating. Clark's nutcrackers are in the crow and jay family, but the first time Captain William Clark saw one in August of 1805, he thought it was a woodpecker. He and Meriwether Lewis collected a specimen in Idaho on their return journey a year later. Clark's nutcracker was one of the three new bird species brought back from their expedition. The oldest Clark nutcracker on record was at least 17 years, five months old. The Clark's nutcracker is one of the few members of the crow family where the males help incubate the eggs. In jays and crows, taking care of the eggs is for the female only. But the male nutcracker actually develops a brood patch on its chest just like the female and takes his turn keeping the eggs warm while the female goes off to get seeds out of her cache. Not only do the lives of Clark's nutcrackers revolve around their pine seed diet, but the pines themselves have been shaped by their relationship with the nutcrackers. White bark pines, limber pines, Colorado pinyon pines, single leaf pinyon pines, and southwestern white pines depend on nutcrackers to disperse their seeds. Over time, this interaction has changed their seeds, their cones, and even the tree's overall shape in comparison with other pine species whose seeds are dispersed by the wind. The Clark's nutcracker tests a seed for soundness by moving it up and down in its bill while quickly opening and closing its bill in a motion known as bill clicking. It also chooses good seeds by color when foraging on Colorado pinyon pines. It refuses all but the dark brown seeds. Ounce for ounce, the white bark pine seeds that many Clark's nutcrackers depend on have more calories than chocolate. Clark's nutcrackers have excellent spatial memory which enables them to cache up to 33,000 seeds in the fall and then locate a large percentage of these seeds during the winter. Caches are generally buried in the soil on exposed slopes and the nutcracker can often find their caches up to nine months later. Not being 100% effective at finding their caches of seeds functions as seed dispersal. When preparing to store seeds, these birds can store as many as 90 seeds in a pouch behind its tongue. This large seed cache allows the Clark's nutcracker to live in high elevations year-round.